Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. It's a girl Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, do not forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Fanny Lungu. If there's something that you guys want us to react to, let us know by dropping the link in the comment section below, and we'll be more than glad to do it. A big shout out to everyone that has subscribed to our channel so far. Thank you for subscribing, liking, commenting, sharing. Everything that you guys do never goes unnoticed. Uh, I hope you guys are doing alright and may you say blessed. A big shout out to the person that suggested this. They suggested I react to Netflix series Shamed Allah Islam. Um, sounds interesting. I wonder what Netflix did this time around otherwise a big shout out to the person that suggested this and feel free to follow us on social media on facebook funny and jesse instagram funny and jesse and feel free to interact with us um if i'm forgetting anything i'm sure it's in the link below and yeah so without wasting time let's get into the video <laughs> Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. I hope you are well. Netflix has yet again shown how Islamophobic it can be towards Muslims and Islam. In a new Netflix series called Snowpiercer, there's an old song which has been incorporated into the series that has ridiculously insulted Islam. The dramatic thriller series is completely discreet and I'm wondering what was the reason for Netflix to include such a song that for no reason will hurt the sentiments of Muslims. Netflix has gone way too far by displaying a half-naked woman singing this ridiculous song in sort of a club, Astaghfirullah, the holy phrase of us Muslims, Allahu Akbar, Allah is the greatest, is openly insulted which makes it more upsetting even though the song to what the defenders say is about unrequited love. I was recommended to make a video on this by a subscriber and after seeing this clip, I was in a dilemma that this song written in 2012 and the lines are engraved in such a manner that it portrays bad perception against Muslims. Many Muslims are angry and hurt on this matter as to how Netflix could openly shame and insult Islam. Indeed, brothers and sisters, this is absolutely unacceptable and completely ridiculous of a giant company like Netflix with millions of viewers from different parts of the world to allow something like this to be displayed in an audiovisual medium. Talking about the song alone, it was written years ago and just like any other song, artists nowadays compose songs which are filled with explicit words. Yet the song too is insulting Muslims and Islam. To all the defenders that are telling Muslims to calm down their nerves and understand the lyrics and not get offended over this, why did Netflix allow this random musical number in its series? And if you have seen the clip, doesn't it leave a negative impact about her religion Islam? Don't you think? Netflix does it all the time to bash Muslims. Brothers and sisters, we are living in a progressive time where respecting and accepting one another is going to be a big part of our future. But with intentions like this, we are degrading and downplaying one religion is going to cast a barrier in doing so. In my opinion, all of this should not be approved and is completely unacceptable and shouldn't be even legal to display on any social platforms. There have been many times where Netflix has aimed at the Muslim community, directly and indirectly. To all my Muslim brothers and sisters, all we can do is boycott such series and movies that are an insult to our religion and faith. The rest we can leave it to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alone. So that's it for today guys. Comment down below what you think on this matter. Also like, share and subscribe to our channel for more videos. Until next time, Assalamu Alaikum. Um... I didn't even know there was such a show on Netflix. It's my first time um, listening, even knowing the title. Otherwise, what we should know by now is that bad news source. That's how these media outlets work. Otherwise, um, as much as Muslims are going to stand up and say something against this, it's in return promoting this series or movie, whatever it is, it's going to promote it. And more people want to watch it. And... I don't, when it comes to Netflix, I feel like it's movies first before people's opinion. What happened with the other 
um, thing they released of children that people found very disturbing. I've forgotten the the what I've forgotten the title, but of little girls that were portrayed in a manner that most parents and people initially didn't respect. Netflix still went ahead and produced that, and people started. Um, talking about it bashing netflix way before the movie was released but netflix ignored what people were saying and still put it out there otherwise that is to say that netflix does whatever it wants even if people campaign against this series movie whatever it is it's getting popularity by people reacting to it by people saying you know what let me see what it says you know what let me see how this singer performed it that's popularity in return otherwise well, I feel like the world should have limits, but then if you limit certain things, people are going to say then where's our freedom of expression? So it's a very, very tricky situation. Let me know what you guys actually think. What are your thoughts of the, on this entire Netflix thing, series, movie? I'm not sure. What do you think about it? Have you watched it? Are you not going to watch it? Have you watched it? You like it? Have you watched it? You don't like it? Or the disrespect is just out of this world what do you think let me know what you think in the comment section below i'll be more than glad to read your responses otherwise make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next reaction video